Here is Benedict. Into the zone with speed come the Panthers and right across the face of goal. Clark gets onto it and scores from the angle. Not quite as many Panthers fans here today as there were on that particular Sunday night. But they're in good voice, although their team's just given the puck away and that could be dangerous! And there's the equaliser, right on cue. And it's player coach Cloutier who gets the job done. It's his first of the season and it's an equalising goal. Oh, sorry, news of another goal in Sheffield. It is now 4-1 to the Steelers. I believe Le Guy has scored one of them, not sure whether it was the third or the fourth. from distance it's a ripping finish and it's Garlo's own I believe or is it Doucet Green never saw it came through a crowd I believe Oh, that's a really poor clearance from Anderson. It could be costly. Mariani couldn't get the touch. And the penalty comes to an end. And yet again, the giveaway in their own end by the Panthers. This one from Nick Anderson, not costly. Oh, Bounce didn't cover it. And that one's costly. It's Chris Murray. All alone, all in front. And late in the period, the Panthers have tied it up. Ryan assesses his options. Weaver comes to Wren. Benedict's trying to provide a screen in front of Bounds. Weaver's trying to shoot through it, and he does. Bounds didn't see it. And Weaver puts the Panthers back on top. trying his best not to hold him and managed to do so Davis leads the stingrays down the ice back to Silverthorne it was touched by Cloutier the backhander is in who else Jeremy Tedler isn't it always already scored two power play goals in this game and they've scored a third through Benedict nice little feed and a nice finish up high Panthers are back in front glad you're enjoying the coverage Lozon just bringing his left hand I think he was maybe he's perhaps trying to buy a, a slashing call didn't get one knocked out of the air by Lozon that's superb and that's the very best we've seen from Carl Lozon and it's an equalising power play goal. We're all tied up at four. Good work from Davis putting Henley under pressure. That's worked out nicely for Davis. Bounce off the official, the backhanded shot, the save by Green and the follow up wide from Davis. Ren clears away, Lakovic leading the charge, trying to stick handle, can't get past Suderman, Salters picks up, Salters moves in, oh and as he moved it to the forehand, he didn't get anything on it, and he came back out in front, and it's been put in by Ren. Panthers want to finish it right here, they might have a chance to. Oh, and they have through David Clark. He scored the first of the night. He might just have scored the last of the night. And the Nottingham Panthers will top the Challenge Cup group and be the number one seeds heading into the quarterfinals.